a meaningful occasion. And all week long, the football chatter has centred around this game and these talented teams. Which one will outwit the other in a packed and passionate stadium? So many questions to be answered on a day of destiny. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, this European Championship qualifier. It's Finland versus Iceland. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Decent looking pass. Well dealt with that ball comfortably. He's given us away. Nicely timed tackle. This is looking threatening. Puki. No chance, perhaps. No tremendous block. Goodmanson. Chance to run at them. Well, he was keen to give that one a go. Sadly, lacking a bit of accuracy. Well, is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. He's going forward well here. A really committed challenge and it's gone out for a throw in. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Paulson. Really good build-up, but no end product. A matter of keeping his composure. Opportunity it is. And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. The ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? It did look on for them, but not to be. Goodmanson. Moving the ball forward, how creative can they be? Will it be? 
Well, that was an opportunity to make the scoreboard look even better from their point of view. Oh, big chance missed that. This game is still very much in the balance. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Kamara went in strongly, decisively. Hurdur Magnusson. A well, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Goodmanson. Kamara. He's showing a real will to win the ball. And providing width. But nothing comes of it. Perfect tackle. Can he finish? Well, it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him. Well, a chance for his second there. Probably should have done a bit better there, really. Playing it in. And just wide of the post. Yeah, decent effort, but not one that was going to trouble the goalkeeper, I don't think. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. And tidy defensive play. And Iceland with the ball again. Well, it wasn't a high percentage chance to add to their advantage, but an opportunity nonetheless. Well, that would have made it more comfortable, but it was a decent effort from there, I have to say. Kamara. Puki. This could level it. Oh, he's missed it! He'll be kicking himself! Well, the opportunity presented itself, and they really should be level. They have to be more composed, more clinical, if they want to get back into this. Well, is it going to end up being productive for them? And there it is! The goal they wanted for security! They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily.
Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. 2-0 now, and back underway. And danger averted. Well read. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. And he's made headway. Oh, superb save. Massive credit to the keeper. Well, he's so hard to beat in these situations. It's brilliant goalkeeping. So making the substitution now. Who can they pick out? And dealt with it nicely. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. No, high quality defending. Well, those stats back up what we've been watching. It's been a really one-sided game. And it's far too easy for them to open up this defence. This could turn into a rout. Oh, wait a minute, Stewart. Look what's happening. And still danger here. Well, he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And it wasn't really the ideal pass. It'll be a throw. Ivanov. A struggle for Finland to keep the ball. Really good build up, but no end product. Anderson. Sigurdsson. And he's in. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Just 20 minutes remaining now. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. And a substitution in the offing. Rasmus Schüler. Trying to open up the defence. That is really alert defending, just when the situation looked dangerous. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. A really effective shielding under pressure. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Distributing it well. Really sound defending. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Now, well, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Can he take the chance? Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. That's a good-looking shot. Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. And that was a very fine read. Can they get in behind them? It needs an accurate cross. And the ball sailing over everyone in the centre. A 
And successfully cut out. Oh, a tremendous block. Delivering it. Blood. Not spot on with that challenge. Can he make it count? And what a magical save it was! Well, as you can see, it wasn't even close, was it? No debate about that one. And he's fired over the corner. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, they were certainly outplayed, no doubt about that. But they showed a lot of character and had a bit of luck, but it's still a very good win for them.
this is when it really hits home. Kickoff time almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams who demonstrably belong on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they do it with the pressure on and the fans wired in? Well, the weather forecasters promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, this European Championship qualifier. It's Iceland up against Portugal. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Attacking with vigour. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Silva. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, a great last time out. Oh, no. Stuart, they might be onto something. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Trying to deliver it accurately. High quality defending. Vitor Ferreira. Rafael Leao. Ferreira. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Beto. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And he could be in proper trouble here. Options in the centre. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. But really sticking to their task defensively. Leao. And defensive play to be applauded. Can he put them in front? Yes, is the emphatic answer. And you have to say, it was on the cards. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. So, back underway. Having conceded, let's find out if Portugal can flick a switch and come up with a goal of their own. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. This is looking threatening. Now he must favour the cross. Well, just the tackle that was needed.
Anderson. And Portugal have it back now. Very quick thinking there. Beto. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. to get his body in the way on a corner kick it is let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage and there's the delivery and it still could be dangerous tremendous block and he's lost custody of the ball here And able to close down the shot. And still dangerous. Well, no way through in the end. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And he's in. Goalkeeping. Well, that's a top quality save. Great anticipation. Over it comes. And the danger's still on. Can he finish? And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved. They've played really well so far. So underway again and a 2-0 advantage here. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. That is that for the first half here. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. And space to cross it. And he takes on the shot. Oh, good save. Substitution time it is here. Now sending it in. Oh, disappointing clearance. Electing to shoot. He's blocked it. And over comes the corner. 
Did well to clear it away. It should be. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. Three goals without reply. Decisive pass, and running in behind, and a goal to delight the fans, just what they were hoping for. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. A lopsided contest, 4-0. And he read it well, intercepting it. Ricardo Pereira. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. Defenders know they need to get tighter. Magnificent defending. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. Thirty minutes to go. Then. And a timely intervention. Anderson. Oh, the threat is there. And Portugal struggling to keep it. And a pretty ordinary challenge. And still a chance. Well, nothing comes of it. Bruno Fernandes has it. Ricardo Pereira. Sigurdsson. Oh, great attacking play. Happy to take on the shot. And just over the bar. Really good effort. Time for a change then. Well, as those stats tell us, their attacking play today has been exceptional. Defenders have come out at the right time. The midfielder completely dominated the game. And the, the front player's movement has been excellent.
a lot of discussion about him prior to this game. Well, every player remembers his first professional start. Memories, memories for you, Stuart. Well, Derek, it was a long time ago, but I can still remember it so clearly. Hopefully, he has a good game today, enjoys the moment, has an excellent career. Well, it happened live on EA TV. Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the... Can he finish? An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, just look at this pass from De Jong, and the finish from Torres gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. Look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. William. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. a super piece of defending and Barca moving the ball with purpose opportunity it is and he struck the post decided to take on the shot from a difficult angle not a memorable effort though well you have to question the decision making there could he have cut it back the angle was always against him. And Betty's come away with it. Luis Felipe. And he's made headway. He can't hold on to it. Oh, in with a chance. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. No, they need to stop him. Is it going to be? And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's not celebrating. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Promising sequence, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Pedri. Torres. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Pedri. 
Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Excellent ball over the top. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. <laughs> Who can they pick out? It hasn't come to very much. Very quick thinking there. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. This looks more than decent. Fancies a pop from here. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And the finish is so critical. He just rolls it past the keeper. Cool as you like. And Betty's doing well to regain possession. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Nicely timed tackle. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. But it's all going rather swimmingly for Barcelona as we near the half-time interval. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, what a totally dominant performance this has been so far. Their attacking play has been a joy to watch. They've passed it forward at the right times, they've switched play quickly, and we've seen some great individual displays as well. I don't think they're let up in the second 45. Is it going to be? He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. first half display and just look at that score Torres and the cross into the middle and the no-nonsense clearance And a timely intervention. Frankie de Jong. It's looking promising. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. The first half here comes to an end. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. 
the tackle completely missed time and you would expect a booking under the circumstances well the referee has taken note of his name and number well i think he can count himself a bit unlucky there but it was certainly a foul They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench.